Good evening everyone, I'm Dominus Sorbus, and today I'm going to be doing Packet Tracer 8.1.2.5, Configuring Syslog and Network Time Protocol. Let's go ahead and get started. This lab is extremely easy because it tells you everything to do. So let's click on the topology, click on Syslog, going to enable the service, on what next configure intermediary devices to use syslog alright I'm gonna go back here R1 tells us where we're going to be logging it to and we're also going to use the switches to do the same that IP is uh, the server where we're sending the logs to Generate logged events. Okay, now we're going to generate events that will be logged by our syslog server by turning off PC1. We'll first configure a loop back in R1 and then disabling it, turning off PC1 and 1 2. And then re enabling them. And if we go back to our syslog server, we can see right here. Line protocol up, down, fast ethernet, zero, one. Change up, down. I thought I did it on the loop back. Oh, here we go. Loop back. On, off. There we go, we got some good events there. Okay, what's next? Our timestamps are incorrect, so now we need to configure NTP. I'm gonna go to switch one, set the clock. Right here, look here, logging to host, port 514 started. It's logging to that server there. Oh, I see what I did. An extra colon in there. There we go.
Now we're going to send timestamps with the syslog on both switches. Need to configure the time on switch 2 as well. Now we're going to configure NTP, go back to the server, It says here it's April 16th, 519. It took my time on my clock, which it is. It is April the 10th, 519. Okay. What's the IP here? That's the server. It's going to be where we sync our time to. Okay. Also going to send the timestamps with the syslog. Let's just uh, create some events here. And there we have it. Here's all the events going down before I set the clock and then as you can see this is the current time April 10th 520 and then the event that happened The only time that's going to be correct are the ones connected to router 1. So right here, whenever I brought that loop back up and down. Because when I turn down those uh, laptops and those PCs, I didn't set the clock to synchronize with the NTP server. So that's why it's showing July or whatever. Anyways. There you have it, how to set up NTP and syslog. Once again, my name is Dominus Orbis. I hope this video has been informative, and I want to thank you for viewing.